listen, I know they're painting this as a young, new generation coming up and fighting the old champion, but that's not the case for this fight. You're going to see youth versus experience. You're going to see, you know, he's going to be fast. He's going to be strong. I don't take anything away from him. You know, he's four inches taller than I am. That's not going to help him. On November 12th, you're going to see the best Amer Abdallah you've ever seen. for an extensive period of time. Uh, very few, very rare. So me staying on top is what's just as important to me as me winning the title. Whole work and dedication. November 12th, it's going down. You know, after, uh, after we beat Daniel Hughes uh, in the fashion that we did, um, it was, it was, I felt too good, I felt too strong, I felt you know, too comfortable to just walk away, even at 39 years old. Um, and we had won the biggest accolade, the biggest accomplishment of my career, a world title. But I don't believe that winning a world title is what defines a world champion. I believe having to defend the title and having to prove that you remain on top that's what makes champions. That's what legacies are built off of, and that's what I'm planning on doing November 12th.